Hey guys, so um, another hot topic here that I wanted to to bring up is a lot of you guys, the first uh, post that I put out, uh, mentioned that your your controller would disappear. Uh, your controller stopped working. Uh, nothing nothing was working. Um, so I just kind of wanted to hop in here and give you guys a fix for that, how I fix it, how I've overcome it, um, to where this works almost 100% of the time um, that I boot my, my Legion Go up. So uh, if you're coming in here and you see, uh, let's see if I can replicate it here. Um, yeah, you see this no physical controller detected. Whoops, I opened up uh, Play Night there. Uh, no physical controller detected here. Um, if you're having that issue, um, there's a multitude of, of things that it could be, but um, mainly what you have to make sure of is first go open up device manager so open up device manager here and you'll see all your different devices um, this is a good example actually since I, I flipped it off for you um, of what not to see so if you're seeing this um, where you're seeing uh, devices that are disabled and you only see one Xbox 360 controller for Windows here there should be two the way to get around this and the way to make this work is anything that's disabled here, right click on it and hit enable. It will say to enable here instead of disable. It'll just have a little down arrow next to the next to the little icon um, when it's when it's disabled. Um, if everything in here is enabled, then what you want to do is when you are on this screen, uh, if you hit the top left Legion button and your top right bumper button, at the same time for one second, so I'm going to do it right now, I'm going to go one and let go, then your joystick's LEDs under your joystick will start flashing and put your controller into a different mode. Once you do that, your Xbox 360 controller for Windows is here and uh, all your controls should be working. And if you come back over to Device Manager again, I'll show you the, the difference here. Um, now that we're in the correct mode and you scroll down, there should be two Xbox 360 controller for Windows down here. That means you're in the right mode. That means it should be working properly.